Hey Leo, what's up? Welcome to the channel. Welcome back. If you've been here before, thank you all so much for joining me. I do appreciate your viewership, engagement, likes, subscriptions, as well as your comments. That greatly benefit my channel, so please keep them coming, y'all. I enjoy every minute of it. All right, thank you in advance. Let's get into your reading. If you are a Leo, if you have Leo placements in your chart, this could resonate. It's not going to resonate for everyone. Take what's yours. Need a rest for someone else. Use your own discernment. Make your own decisions, all right? Don't try to force anything to fit. That's not your story. This could also be past, present, or future energy or someone around you I'm picking up on. So flip the rose if you need to. All right, Leo. Person on your mind, what do they want to say? We start off with, or maybe we haven't finished our journey yet in the past life, and now we're here together again. Okay, so somebody feels like you're a past life soulmate. They come in with some unfinished business from a past life, and they're like, we're going to close this out. So we can go ahead and um, elevate and evolve to the next level. We can go ahead on to the fifth dimension and don't have to come back to earth anymore. <laughs> they ain't trying to reincarnate. I am not available. Uh-oh. Let's see. Now it says, or maybe, look, I am not available, or maybe we haven't finished our journey yet in the past life, and now we're here together again. Okay, so let's see. We'll see. We're going to clarify with the tarot. What's going on here with your person? <clears throat> soon. I'm going to contact you soon. Gemini had that. I believe it was Gemini. Yeah, Gemini. So someone maybe um, hasn't been emotionally available or available, period, physically. But they're about to reach out to you because you have unfinished business. We have palm tree. Stability, security, permanence, growth, endurance, and flexibility. Okay. Somebody wants to offer you something stable and solid. There is no one else thinking about you all day. So they want you to know that they are... Um, you know, inability to be available doesn't have anything to do with them. They're missing you too. Um, being with anyone else. Let's see. Or maybe we haven't finished our journey yet in the past life, and now we're here together again. What do they want to say about this past life soulmate energy? The Knight of Wands, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, the Eight of Cups. This person wants to chase you after a period of maybe walking away, turning their back on the connection. They could have thought that the grass was greener somewhere else, went to look for their other two cups here <laughs> with the eight of cups being here. We, we know we strive for the ten of cups as fulfillment, right? As happily ever after. They could have felt like they had to go another direction. This could be past life energy. They could have walked away in the past. Maybe this person was a player. You could have walked away from them because they were a player. Uh, Pisces energy, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Yeah, some of you chose to walk away from this person. They left you out in the cold. Could be a Taurus. Somebody was being a player. Now, Leo, this is your energy with the Knight of Wands. So I don't know if that's you. Like I said, flip it if you need to. Somebody walked away because they were left out in the cold by somebody playing around. I'm not available. Maybe emotionally unavailable. Yep. Page of Pentacles, a younger Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Somebody preoccupied with their money. Again, they say that they were not dealing, they're not dealing with anyone else right now. They probably were in the past. But they also could have been pursuing, um, the Knight of Wands can be somebody pursuing any kind of passion. It doesn't have to be another human being. It could just be that they were focused on their own success or, you know, conquering some type of challenge or overcoming some kind of obstacle. He had four Pentacles here. Definitely somebody that was, Worried about their money. Capricorn energy with the four pentacles. They weren't available. They were guarded because they were worried about money. This person could be at retirement age. Or they could have, they could have told you that they were saving money. They could have just started a new job. Maybe they could be in school. They could be working and in school. This person could be saving money to buy a car, a home, or some kind of major purchase here. That's what the four pentacles represents. The nine of wands. Again, they were very guarded. This person is very guarded. Leo energy. What's soon? I'm going to contact you soon. Yeah, Ace of Swords. Expect some communication for sure. This person is coming in with clear communication with the Ace of Swords, a Libra, Aquarius, or Gemini. I told you Gemini had the same energy. You could be connected to a Gemini. This is a person who's very clear. They have clarity now. They have strong feelings for you, and they want to communicate that to you. Beautiful. I mean, if you want them back. I can't tell you to take them back. The Empress... Yes, very much in love with you. Very attracted to you. A lot of sexual chemistry. 
a lot of love, a lot of feelings. They have very strong feelings for you. This person wants to take care of you. Two of Wands. Hmm. Aries energy. We have Libra and uh, Taurus as well. This person is planning for the future with you. They see a future with you and they're planning to offer you something here. Um, also, you could be pregnant by this person. The Empress is a pregnancy card. Or you could end up pregnant when they come back your way. What's palm tree? This person wants to offer you security and stability. I told you that. Ten of Pentacles, a firm foundation. Virgo for some of you. This person ain't playing no more. They learned their lesson. Ace of Pentacles, security and stability. You cannot make it up. It's clarifying the same energy over and over again. They want to come in as a solid partner. This person's money is good now. If it wasn't good in the past, I feel like this is a creative person, an entrepreneur. Knight of uh, Swords here. Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. Expect communication. Very quick communication coming in. This is impulsive. Somebody just wake up today. I'm going to call Leo. What's there? No one else thinking about you all day. Wow, the star. They want to heal this connection. They're optimistic that you two can pull it off in Aquarius for some of you. <clears throat> the Knight of Pentacles, they want a long-term commitment with you. They're wishing on a star. <laughs> Y'all don't mind my voice. I don't know what's going on. My voice is so crack, cracky and... It's just a cracked voice every day. I don't know what's going on. Um. Anyway, but this person wants to offer you long-term commitment. They want to heal this connection. They want to come back and make it right. Even with the Knight of Swords, that's someone who wants to come back in and get you back. Four of Cups because they have been missing you and thinking about where they went wrong. Cancer energy. Bottom of the deck, we have two of Pentacles. They're ready to prioritize you now. Some of them were juggling you with their career, working multiple jobs, or even juggling you with other people. Capricorn energy. All right, so those are your messages, Leo. This person is coming in with some communication. They want a new beginning with you because they're clear now that they want to be in a relationship with you. They're seeing you as their empress. They want to take care of you. They want to provide for you. They want to offer you security and stability. And it could be that they were trying to get their money right first before they did that. Definitely somebody stuck on you from the past, Scorpio energy, and wanting to work with you. Capricorn energy with the three of pentacles. They see you as a good team player. Somebody they can really build with, do business with, live with, marry, commit to, all of that good stuff. All right, y'all like the video. Subscribe, hit the notification bell, and leave me a comment if this is worth it. And I'll see you all when I see you all. Peace.